I'm Tina. Hi, Tina. Oh, oh, oh right here. Oh. Yeah. Okay, so what you want to do is you want to make a big well and then crack three eggs. And then we'll make three. Go for it. Go for it. Can't break eggs. There you go. Me, who's never broken an egg. Oh, exactly. <laughs> this, is, this is a good time. Good times, Annie. Yeah. yeah. I mean, different hands come out with a different texture. Yeah, yeah. 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 We have big, strong hands. I'm also dressed for, I just, I came from a family reunion now, so I don't usually wear my pearls. <laughs> <laughs> Just thought it was going to be filming. It's a good day. I'll wash my hair. Is this like you do have a little dry there? I'll just put a little bit of mochi in. That's good. Oh, that's good. Mm -hmm. That's good. Do you? I haven't started. It's no, your turn. I'm going to scrape away this while it still works, otherwise, it's going to be a big waste of money. Oh, that's lovely as well. Yeah. 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 So you can cover make it them. into a little ball and cover it. And let it sit. Mm -hmm. Just put that one ball in there. Let's cover it. So it doesn't go dry. This is the type of flower that dries. Yeah, it's, it's kind of harder than the softly flowered you make for yeah. the last of the peppers. I've been eating um, peppers and anchovies for days and days and days. And this is pretty nice, guys, just here in Chetando. Husband and wife team, they just have a couple of fields and they do everything. So they grow the wheat to take it down to the mill to be stone ground. But when you stone ground flour, you can't get it very, very, very fine. So it's not double zero. It's not very, very fine flour. You'll see it looks slightly brownish. Mm -hmm. I miss so. Do it. Do it as. You leave it a bit. See, 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 make it a little bit. Or it's just a more strong. I'll do my hand. I'll do my drawers. I didn't say it this time. She's she's had a couple of weeks. She said, I remember smelling my grandfather's. I'm going to be like, uh -huh. <laughs> She's straight. <laughs> Would you like to tell her your name again? Jane, come on down. With that, with the bowl. Mix the custard, and it needs to be mixed in the same direction, which we think might be an old wives' tale, but we do it anyway just in case. Clockwise or counterclockwise? Double clockwise. Nice. 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 Nice.
Oh. So they're baked yeah. twice. Biscotto means baked yes. twice. Yes. Bis. Yeah. Oh, and that never registered. Right. Biscotto no. makes sense. Right. Yeah. So also in French. She told that was a little bit of Italian. And then yeah. what, what is the bit that says baked twice? Bis. Bis. That's Latin. So. Perché right. se siamo al biscotto pronto, yeah. dopo è un problema tagliato. Okay, so we have to cut them as soon as they're glazed. Would you? Yeah. Uh, so, you need to cut these in strips, right? Yeah. Um, By putting yes. glaze on them? Yeah. Onion, basil, and tomato. And tomatoes, uh -huh. which I then put, either you, you cut them up with a mezzaluna or you want them in a food process uh -huh. a little bit, because it's not, you don't want the whole mm -hmm. to be crushed. Right. I put one and a half of these in. Right, yeah. But usually, even the organic tomatoes that I found in America have, have sugar in them at least. Uh, yeah. They're always in the other. It's always Italian like that. Mm -hmm.